For decades, the Red Sea's spectacular coral reefs have been attracting visitors in increasingly large numbers. But this popularity has come at a price. Damage from boat anchors has been laying waste to some of the most precious reefs in the Red Sea. In the early 1990s, a group of dive operators responded by establishing the Hurghada Environmental Protection and Conservation Association. Hepke got started by putting in place moorings to protect the fragile reefs from further degradation. On the waters of Hurghada, a mooring team from Hepke is preparing to go underwater. Team leader Mostafa Abdallah has been closely involved in the setup of what is now the largest mooring system in the world. From the initial 100 moorings around Hurghada, the system now extends along the entire Egyptian Red Sea coast, with the concept being adopted by other countries in the region. أعتقد إن أنجح مشاريع الجامعة محافظة على البيئة هبكة الفترة اللي فاتت أو ده مش ما ده شو الفترة اللي فاتت في خلال عشرين سنة اللي فاتوا أكيد هي مشروع الشمندرات ومثالي أنجح حاجة حصلت في مشروع الشمندرات نحن عرفنا إن الإحساس بملكية المشروع ده لكل مركب لكل مركز غطس لكل رئيس لكل مستخدم في البحر لأن بدون تضافر جهود كل المساهمين في المشروع والمستخدمين للمشروع أكيد المشروع ما كانش حقق النجاح اللي وصل له دلوقتي. Following the success of the mooring project, Hepke's work expanded into other areas of environmental protection. <laughs> 